Hey guys, Christoph here, and this time I'm going to be playing Undertaker's Road to WrestleMania on SmackDown vs. Raw 2009. So without further ado, let's do this. I hope everyone's doing well. Not uploaded in a few days, been really busy. And there he is. The legend. Yes, he has. Twice. I'm sure Mark Calloway can talk for himself, but okay. I tell you what, guys, I am not happy at all lately. I'm not happy in the slightest because ever since my Rocky Balboa live stream, all five subscribers that I actually gained, I fucking lost and I'm really not happy about it. So, if any of them have seen this video right now, thanks a lot, you fucking knobheads. Go rot in hell. Because ever since I posted my update video with my wife, I literally lost all five subscribers. So, safe to say I won't be doing no sub for sub live streams anymore. Fuck them. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in for a stellar main event here as the dead man. Santino Morello. He had to retire due to a neck injury. Fun fact, he now um, teaches self defense classes for kids. Old school. The Undertaker is a surefire Hall of Famer with two decades of destruction. This man takes no prisoners, and Santino Morella will be no. So expensive. yeah, excuse oh, me if I seem a little off. I'm really annoyed of losing them subscribers. A vicious stop. Seems like every time I look on my uh, subscriber count, it always seems to be fucking going down. We might be seeing the beginning of the end. He's showing absolutely no respect for his opponent. Oh, oh shit. Uh oh. Bastard. Oh my, the what the fuck was that? Was incredible. That's a you fucking headbutt somewhere. The dead man has Santino with the ropes. Can he finish this one off? What a counter. Oh, crap. There are limits to the amount of punishment that a human body can absorb. And if you want proof of that, just take a look at these superstars. Okay. Mm, finish him off now. Santino Morello was never actually a real major player or like a
like a main eventer. He was like a lower mid card talent at best. I'll be streaming again soon. But I don't know what I'm going to be streaming, so I'll have to work that out nearer to the time. Okay, this time I have to defeat Finley um, in less time than I do with Santino. They have to defeat him a lot faster. See, in less than two and a half minutes to earn a bonus, even though I've already done it, but it doesn't matter. My name is Finley, and I love even though Finley's long since retired, he's now a backstage producer. I'm going to put this guy away as quick as possible. Oh shit. Bastard. Seven seconds to spur. I'm against the Great Carly for the World Heavyweight Championship. Even though the Great Carly is one of the worst wrestlers ever. He's not even really a wrestler. He'd do maybe a big boot or a couple of chops and then he'd put you away. Or one big slam and that's it. One would hardly call that a wrestler. Oh, that stupid fucking vice grip thing. Either way, he's going down. Two monsters will collide in the ring tonight. What a main event. Undertaker versus the great Kali. It literally doesn't get any bigger than this. Talk about educated a striking elbow staggering the opponent. A vicious DDT sending a shockwave on the opponent's head and neck. A vicious stomp. No telling what impact that might have had on the neck and spine. Can Undertaker keep his momentum rolling? He's been victorious over Finley and Santino in recent weeks. But will he have the Punjabi Nightmares name to that list? Hell's get. Be 
Ouch. That's like a UFC move or something, like MMA. I think. I'm no expert on UFC or anything. And there is the DDT. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. What a nasty elbow. A vicious elbow drop. Delivers with a lot of force. This is it. Here we go. And again. Fun fact, The Undertaker actually does have a black like belt. I think it's in judo. I'm not sure. Oh, man. What a I watched one of them um, top ten videos on The Undertaker a while ago. I've been in this move before, play fighting with friends when I were a kid, and it really does hurt. The Boston Crab. There's the elbow. He's looking to put his opponent away right here. This should do it. There's the cover. Oh, you bastard. Shit, what's happening? Whether you like it or not, oh, are you kidding me? Right there. Seriously? That fool? Oh, shit. Thanks, Santino. You cost me a, uh, a chance at the World Championship, though, you clone. Two guys aren't enough to take out the Phenom. And he beats them up regardless. Okay. Next. Yep, yeah, they're sick and tired of The Undertaker. So they're forming a new stable called New School. Who has a secret leader. New School? Finley's fucking old? And Santino was like a rookie. Chokeslam. Oh, you bastard. And there is the Dink. DDT. Look at this. Could it be? Tombstone pile driver. How many superstars have fallen victim to that over the years? What? He may get 
the three, two, two right here. Three. It's never been. I don't believe it. This one's over. Royal Rumble. It's a shame I'm not actually in the Royal Rumble. I wonder who I'm against. Oh, Santino and Finlay. What a surprise. To keep these Road to WrestleMania storylines a bit fresh, they could actually put a few more opponents in there. Obviously, instead of you just facing the same opponents constantly, it gets a bit stale. They obviously must have stole the urn from Paul Burrow, even though at this time he's kayfabe dead. Even though now he's actually really dead. This urn has weakened my character a bit. <laughs> that didn't really do much damage. Considering Santino's basically a cruiserweight wrestler. And The Undertaker's like a super heavyweight. Because there must be at least 90 pounds weight difference. I think he's through playing around! Oh, you can't. Well, the Undertaker will never count. It doesn't matter if it's one, two, or twenty men. The Phenom backs down from no board. What a decapitating lariat. There's the cover. Can he do it? Do it. Wow. I thought he had the oh, pin for sure. Fuck. That's the worst things with these uh, two on ones. Oh shit. What a nice Whoa, oh, shit, what the fuck? Whoa. And I think that TDT did the I thought slip. they were gonna get the Look fucking the slip on me then. Oh the punch connects. And there's a stiff clothesline. And that's a stiff kick. Oh what a devastating choke slam. There we go. Should be done now. This could be three right here. One, two, three. There we go. The referee's calling for the match. Eat that, the match is over. motherfucker. <sighs> he started to fend them off, then he got whacked in the back of the head with the urn. And laid out.
I've got no time for these shitty cutscenes. It's just them doing promos. Kane is under new school's control. To break the trance, give him a tombstone twice. Okay. Yeah, they seem to have possessed Kane. Glenn, whatever you want to call him. Come on, Glenn. Let's go. a lot of head trauma to break the trance. Okay. And that's two. Yes, Michael Cole. How many times have you said that over the years? I can't tell if that's a cut or a broken nose, but either way, the referee might need to stop this fight. Okay. Glitch. <laughs> okay, he snapped him out the trance. They're going to reform the Brothers of Destruction to take on New School. A couple more matches and then I'll have to end the video. And then he laughs. Okay. My name is Finley, and I love to fight. There's the bell, and I think I see a hit of a smile on Undertaker as his brother gets some measured revenge on the school. A vicious blow to the opponent. I'm going to beat the holy shit out of Santino. While Kane beats the shit out of the old man, Finley. Finley's WWE career didn't really make much of an impact. It was quite forgettable, to be honest. If it weren't for Hornswoggle, nobody would really remember him. He won a, one championship and didn't even hold it long. And that was the US championship. He never won a match at WrestleMania. Look at this! No fear on the face of this superstar! Okay. Shit. Here we go. All good things must come to an end. But I wish that match could have yeah, gone on fight. a little longer. Get a chair. Oh shit. Sorry, ref. I twined the ref. Oops. Oh, fuck. Fuck's sake. 